March Madness in full swing on the ice as well, with a pair of local schools sitting just one win away from a trip to the Division Three Frozen Four. Seven's Chelsea McDonald has more on Endicott and Curry College's chase for the D3 crown. We play hard, we play fast, and we're a disciplined team. Keep things simple, nothing special from us. Just work hard. That's exactly what Endicott College did to clinch the Commonwealth Coast Conference title and earn a bye week before hosting their first ever NCAA tournament game against Norwich. That momentum we talked about, it, it's been built up for the last four years. This year it's been a, a whole new level and um, we know our ceiling, like we know we can, we can do it and if we put everything together in the right way, uh, success should come our way. And Curry College is hoping success continues for their program after earning their first ever NCAA tournament victory beating Bowdoin. That meant the world to us, you know, we've been working hard uh, since uh, the end of August as a team, grinding and uh, you know, we just got to keep going. I think the biggest thing is just to play our game. Uh, obviously Hobart's a really good team, but uh, we're going to prepare, we've been watching film and uh, just stay in the moment. The win over Bowdoin prepared the Colonels for the intensity of the tournament as they get set to face Hobart on Saturday. We had a stumble there in the CCC uh, Conference Championship to, to a really good Endicott team and you know so we tried to get back to, to our identity as a group and that's you know playing fast, playing with the puck, playing confident. And if both the goals and the Colonels advance to the D3 Frozen Four, they'll face each other in a rematch of the CCC title game. At Endicott College, Chelsea McDonald, 7 Sports.